Greetings, I'm Noor Saidi, your homeroom teacher. Let's get introduced to our first unit in English. In our transdisciplinary theme, where we are in place and time, we will focus on the central idea, exploring family history and origin contributes to people understanding the relationship between the past and the present. We will cover these skills through our unit. In speaking and listening, your learning outcomes are actively engage in both small and large group discussions, gradually extend your participation duration as instructed, utilize your comprehension skills to anticipate outcomes when listening to text being read aloud, pose questions to enhance your knowledge and provide accurate response to inquiries effectively, in viewing and presenting skills, your learning outcomes are, in accordance with the classroom instructions, you will compare various renditions of a single story, evaluating the different storytelling methods. Connect these narratives to your personal experiences, drawing parallels with diverse contexts depicted in visual text. Employ your body language, effectively conveying ideas and emotion visually. In your reading skills, your learning outcomes are to actively engage in read aloud sessions by listening attentively and responding proactively. This includes making predictions and envisioning potential outcomes based on the material presented. Participate effectively in guided reading activities, observe and employ appropriate reading strategies while interacting collaboratively within the group. Recognize an expanding collection of high frequency words and captivating words, character or symbols, enhancing your overall reading comprehension and vocabulary. In your writing skills, your learning outcomes are take pleasure in the process of writing and develop a sense of appreciation for your own creative endeavors and express your thoughts and personal experiences in an informal writing. Display an understanding of the conventions of written text, such as sequencing, spacing, and directionality. Use your writing effectively convey messages to specific audience, whether it is crafting a news story, providing instructions, or creating a fantastical narrative. Types of text that we will be learning about are informative and explanatory text. In spelling and phonics, we will be learning about short vowels. In grammar, we will learn how to construct simple sentences. And with the unit of inquiry in English lessons will be through engaging in both listening and reading activities involving short stories, articles, and informational texts centered around themes of family history, change, and traditions. In writing exercises, generate prompts that explore the significance of family traditions and articulate their importance. Actively participate in discussions with family members, observing their personal stories, depicting diverse cultures and traditions. Conduct interviews with family members to delve into a specific tradition that has been passed down or an event from the past. Learning English equips you with fundamental language skills such as fostering effective communication, critical thinking, cultural awareness, and personal expression. Bye-bye. See you in class, grade 2A.